here's a Samsung S24 Ultra that I primarily use for its camera system because I think as of the posting of this video, the Samsung S24 Ultra has the best camera in a mobile phone. So I bought this phone pretty much just for this camera to be my travel camera. I've made other videos of how much I praise the Samsung S line, the 20, uh, I think I, all the way back from the 20 or the 21, 22, 23, and now the 24. Uh, I really like this as a camera. But I'm a Mac user, and Android phones don't play well with Macs. So what I've been having trouble with was putting the footage and the photos that I've been taking on this S24 onto my Mac. Previously, I've been using the Android File Transfer app. This is an app that you can install for free on your Mac, and then when you plug in your uh, Android phone, you can read the camera like a hard drive and then just dump transfer the footage to your uh, uh, your mac but recently this uh, has been unsupported and doesn't really exist anymore that i can find enter mac droid so if you're searching for the same issue that i'm searching for mac droid apparently is the only sort of reputable software that can do the same thing so here it connects to your Android to your Mac without any barriers, it says. So I installed MacDroid to my Mac and I haven't had the best of results. It says it's free, but if you wanna use all of the functions of this app, you have to pay for it. So I ended up paying about $35 uh, for the full capabilities of this app and I've had issues with it. It works but I found that it was a very, it took a long time to load. So even though I just bought MacDroid and I use it and, it and it works, I am not happy with it. So my solution now, and what I'm gonna do moving forward, is something that I'm sure Android users are already aware of and probably use themselves, is this USB port right here. Uh, you can plug in a hard drive or a thumb drive and the phone will read the thumb drive or the hard drive as an external drive. And you can then copy all of your video footage, photos into that thumb drive and then put the thumb drive into your Mac. So here's a thumb drive right here. I've already formatted this and you have to pre-format this if you're going from a Android to a Mac. So you have to format this in XFAT. XFAT, format the drive in XFAT. And then once this is formatted in XFAT, that means it could read both PC and Mac. So once that's formatted, I have my phone, I have some footage that I wanna copy over. I'm gonna plug this into my phone. Then you're gonna to go to your My Files. And then once you're on the My Files, there's the storage, USB storage, select that. I've already created a folder inside there, and that is this folder right here. So here's my photo gallery. I go up here, I hit edit what I wanna select. Let's say I wanna select those clips, and then I'll go to here, copy to clipboard, hit the thumb drive folder, go to those three dots and paste here. And then now it's pasting over the clips that I copied over. And that was a pretty fast paced job. Then I go to the USB storage, I'm gonna unmount it. Once it unmounts, I can unplug this. And then now all of those photos and videos are on this thumb drive. I plug the thumb drive into my Mac and then I could download it. And that's how I am now going to copy all of the files from the uh, S24 Ultra here into a Mac. I'm not gonna use those softwares anymore. This is just a better way to do it.